Clarabelle. Clarabelle's fantastic. Hi, Clarabelle. You just gotta wave as we go by. All right, we're gonna have to keep checking back to see if we can get into Blue Bayou, but I found a Disney's version of Hot Topic. Oh my gosh. Ma, you big fan of Nightmare Before Christmas? Oh, what'd you say? So Not so much. Yeah. That's okay, but if you want any of that kind of stuff here, um, there is a store. It also has Haunted Mansion stuff in here too. It's actually pretty cool theming. And then Pirates Caribbean store, straight down the way too. So yeah, lots of different things to be choosing from. Last for no attraction, Sleeping Beauty Castle. Just over here, Fancy Land. There you go. You walk in here and learn the story of Aurora. A couple of stairs, admittedly. Which is the fun part, right, Nina? Yeah. Get your steps in. Now again, unlike Cinderella's castle, where you don't really have an attraction, you've got a restaurant. Here you've got something. Which is pretty great. Yep. Burning all of the spinning wheels. Because that is the best way to take care of it. I love it. with you and your hat, why? And despite it all, true love prevailed. Except for Maleficent, it maybe isn't dead. Oh my gosh, how? How, Nanette? There's a sequel. There's a sequel. There we go. And at the end here, you can watch your dress change from make it pink, make it blue, make it pink. Make it pink. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> we have a little extra time, so we're going on the greatest ride here in Disneyland. No, I'm just kidding. Not the greatest, but uh, Pinocchio's Daring Journey. My mom does not remember it, so uh, we're going to try it out. I'm really curious to see what she thinks of it, because it's kind of depressing. Uh, it's got a nice ending, except for the fact that he doesn't turn into a real boy. Is anybody else bothered by this? I feel like I'm the only one who's talking about it. I love this big mural, so cool. Oh, I forgot to mention, I think, but uh, Soren was like about an hour wait. One hour, but worth it. Also, if you're gonna wait that long, just wait for B1. Section B, row one, it's the best one. But yeah, this ought to be uh, pretty interesting. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Uh, and he's still a puppet. Welcome to the clock room. All right. What did you think? I wanted him to turn into a real boy. Yeah, turn into a real boy, right? Right. Uh, and, it, and it's also kind of sad too, right? Yeah. Straight from her. You have done it. You successfully infiltrated the Blue Bayou. I don't know, I just asked. But yeah, so if you do walk up, you can sometimes get that, but it's not always guaranteed. It's better to make a reservation. Right now, they're doing reservations up to 60 days out, but you have to get up pretty early in the morning to get them, because they will go within about 15 minutes. I think it's something like six o'clock Eastern time they go live, which is kind of funny, so just keep that in mind if you want to book something. But again, 60 days, six zero days out. But I'm excited. I'm have, you, have you eaten here before? Yeah. Yeah. You've never eaten here? What? What? Oh my gosh. It's gonna be so good. I can't wait. Ah, uh, because last time I was sitting over there across the way and I was just by myself. But now I got something. Hey, here, here you are. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, I'm so excited. I can't wait. 
All right, we'll we'll show you more once we get inside. I'm trying not to cry. Oh my gosh, we're just going in and over here, over to a Riverside table. I can't even. Oh my gosh, everybody, be cool. We're now sitting at a Riverside table, and there are the QR codes if you want to scan them and see what we have as options on the menu currently. Uh, Ma ended up getting the Monte Cristo, and I got the Surf and Turf because that's what I get when I come here. Whoa, it's blurring you out. There you go. There she is. All right. Yeah, no, no, not at all, not at all. But yeah, we're gonna wait for our food. Maybe wave at a few boats. Maybe someone will wave at us right now. If we wave at them, let's wave. They're filming. I'm, oh, there's one in the back. You're the best. That guy's the best. We love him. Thank you. Here's a roll. Uh, <laughs> he caught it. He caught it. See, that joke plays. <laughs> I love this place. Got the Monte Cristo here. It's kind of hard to see it for some odd reason. It is. But that's because we're in the dark. Are you excited about the Monte Cristo? I think so. And also, I got the Surf and Turf, which is much larger than the last Surf and Turf I got, uh, which is great. I'm excited to dig in, and hopefully I can show you guys a little bit better shortly. There we go, there's the Surf and Turf for you. All right, how's that Monte Cristo treating you? It's so good. It's so good? It's one of the favorites around here. They say, oh, hello, that looked great. Oh, wonderful. A little powdered sugar on top. A nice locale meal. No, it's it, the thing is here you work off your calories. That's right. Right? In Disneyland, all calories are halved. That's just how it works. <laughs> I'm taking the first bite. Here we go. It's so good. Um, you know? Maybe not as flavorful as the Lasselle, but so is that kind of blackened top. Fantastic. And I'm already gonna tell you right now, the lobster it's mostly just a vehicle for butter. So that's what I'm just gonna, you know, that's what I'm gonna worry about. But yeah, still really, really good. All right, we just got out of Blue Bayou. What did you think? It was amazing. It was amazing. Amazing. Yeah. It was amazing. And now we're heading over to Peter Pan's flight because we decided to hop in. It's never a short line unless you're here right at rope drop. We're like, we just gotta do it. We just gotta do it while we can, right? Uh, but anyway, that, that steak and that lobster, oh, so good. And waving at people, 100% strike rate. Not everybody on the boat, but I've got somebody in every boat that I waved at. I got a pity wave from one guy. I'll take it though. I'll take it. Uh, I can sit there for hours, just eat food. Oh, it's lovely. Here we're gonna do this, and then maybe I'm gonna go on Matterhorn again, maybe. Because Matterhorn's amazing, remember? Yeah, and then uh, maybe a little fireworks, a little Splash Mountain. I don't know, we'll see what else we get into. We just got off Peter Pan's flight, and what did you think of it? I like the stars. Yeah, those stars look really nice. Do you think it was worth the wait? Yes. Okay, I, yeah, Oh. It's gonna be hard to watch it back later. Anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah, I also really enjoyed it. I thought it was actually really good. And, fun little fact about it, it's way smoother and quieter than the one in Walt Disney World. And it's got like drops and stuff in it. I was not expecting it. You, It's kind of a, it's a quick ride, but it's a really fun ride. Now we're gonna hop on the carousel because it's a classic and mom wanted to do it. So, here we go. Ah, we're on the carousel, there's mom. We're racing, but I think she's winning because she put the starting line back there. Please make sure we do Remy between the sides of two horses and facing forwards. And please do not hang on to that outside bolt. Thank you. <laughs> there we go. Carousel. Woo! Ma, how are you doing? Mom's sitting here with the Disneyland popcorn. And she loves it. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna sit here for a second. Relax, make a phone call or two, while I go on the Matterhorn. It's behind the trees. I swear it's over there. It really is, but Matterhorn, remember, ooh, ooh. All right, let's go. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time once again for the Matterhorn. It's still behind trees. Why do I keep getting shots with the trees? I don't know.
seatbelt fastened. I will. Permanece sentado. I hope you guys saw that. Aladdin stole a loaf of bread from the marketplace, but he also stole the heart of Princess Jasmine. With the power of true love and the magic of the genie, Aladdin and Jasmine were married and still live in the palace to this very day. True love blooms forever here in Storybook Land, just like the flowers you can see in the arches above us. It was under this endless diamond sky where Princess Jasmine and Aladdin first flew over, sideways, and under on a magic carpet ride towards a whole new world. <laughs> And now, our story takes a mysterious turn as we enter the Cave of Wonders. The very same cave where Aladdin was sent to search for the genie's lamp, which was sent to grant three wishes. Let's all make a wish and see if it comes true. And Snow White was running from the evil queen when she found the cottage of the seven dwarfs. On the right-hand page of our storybook, in turn for her kindness, the seven dwarves offered Snow White shelter. We just got off the storybook land canals, and what did you think? It was cute. It was cute, yeah. And we just want to say, good job, Taylor. You did a wonderful job. We waited probably, what do you think, 20 minutes, 15 minutes, maybe? Maybe 15 minutes, 20, maybe for it. It's a cute little ride, and I highly recommend going on at night. Way more charming. And now we're just grabbing a spot to watch Mix It Magic, maybe that's the name? I don't know. Uh, but we're gonna be in front of the castle this time because last night we weren't, but tonight we will be. So as you can see, we're standing right here. Bada boom. Castle, right there. Yeah, so we'll probably show you a couple highlights from that. But uh, for us, we have to wait a half hour. You guys, it's gonna be just a few seconds. Here we go. watching Mickey's Mix Magic. It's a little alliteration there for you. Ma, what did you think? Uh, <laughs> the visuals were riveting on the castle. Yes. So riveting I could hardly watch the fireworks. Ah. Uh, I don't know. It was not magical, but it was entertaining. Yeah, it's definitely a different vibe than what you get at Disney World. Disney World's got kind of... Um, Nostalgia. Nostalgia, yeah, it's more like heartwarming and that kind of thing. This is more supposed to, I think this is supposed to tire out the youth, uh, <laughs> as it were. Uh, but yeah, so it was fine. It was a pretty good show. And yeah, she was saying it's really, uh, the castle projections and along Main Street are so good. Yeah. And um, eye-catching that it's hard sometimes to catch or like watch the fireworks weirdly. It really was. <laughs> I was like, wait, I gotta look over here. Yeah, like, uh, and that's so true. And they don't go right behind the castle, so that's kind of a consideration as well. But anyway, it was fine. We're, we're gonna head over to Splash Mountain. I did a quick, brief, quiet, well not a quiet ride, but I went on Big Thunder, and it was spitting rain, and I could feel it. I was like, it's a new water feature. Oh. Went through really fast. It's like a walk-on. Uh, I, didn't, I didn't film anything, I just went on without it. Sometimes, that's what I gotta do. And that's probably what we're gonna do here at Splash Mountain. So I showed it the other night, and I don't want the camera to get wet. <laughs> I feel like I'm always playing this dangerous game of chicken with Mother Nature, and eventually, she will win. Uh, <laughs> knock on wood. There's wood right here. Knock, 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 knock. Okay. Okay. Thank goodness. Oh, there's some more here. Okay. Good. Okay. okay. Woo. There we go. I'm not superstitious. I'm mildly stitious. If anybody knows that reference, you let me know in the comments. We're gonna go on Splash Mountain. I'll show you a little bit of the queue and stuff. You excited? I love Splash Mountain. Oh yeah. It's so good. Hopefully they'll put us in the back. Thank you. He's doing it. Here we are, back on Splash, because this is what we do, Splash Mountaineers, or something like that. We just love this ride. And you know what? 
I bet that overlay or the new retheming and all that stuff will be great. As long as they keep the track the same, which I think they will. Because this one, it, this one cooks. Oh my gosh. Just walking in time to the music. It's beautiful. Uh. What did you say? Oh, yeah, right? <laughs> kind of a walk on. See, we love going on Splash at night. It's not a lot of people. Now I understand a lot of people don't want to get wet at night. But, you just go back to your room when you're done. See? Look at that, listen to that music. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we're gonna walk right on this puppy. Okay, wish us luck. Here we go. I'm always gonna, I'm forever gonna love that. You're just like. It's perfect. <laughs> it's perfect. <laughs> uh, that was one of the most intense rides I've ever had on Splash Mountain, probably the best. Uh, it was just the two of us. We were sitting in rows two and three. I was sitting in row two. So when we hit the laughing place drop, uh, water came kind of up and over the boat uh, or the log. It's pretty intense, pretty wet, uh, mostly on the right side. That's what happens if you go on that one. Watch out for the right legs. If you uh, have a full party, I recommend putting the big boned individuals in the very back uh, because if you put anybody in the front, who is like my size, like a six foot tall, kind of like bigger guy, like you're gonna get water in the boat. Uh, <laughs> Even my mask is soaking wet. Yep, so good. But this was so much fun. I hope you guys had a good time with us. If you wanna see more Disneyland stuff, just let me know in the comments, because guess what? I live here now. <laughs> it's kind of crazy to believe, but I plan on doing more of this stuff in the future. So uh, let me know, and let me know if you want to see more of Ma in the videos. We'll just so get her out. She can come back. She can come back any time. Uh, <laughs> we had a super fun time, and I hope you guys did as well. Uh, I think that takes care about everything. Anything else you want to say to Neth before we head out? No, it was a wonderful time with one of my favorite people on Earth. Ah! So, yeah, it's perfect. Well, good, because it was my, it was a wonderful time for me with my favorite person on Earth. Ha! See, I gotcha. The best one. Love you too. All right, and we love you guys. Thank you for watching. And until next time, just remember to adapt and overcome. Bye bye.